Hey, what's going on, CoinOptTV subscribers? Robert Welkner here. I haven't done a proper vlog of me out and about in quite a while. Apologies, but just been live streaming and switching things up a lot in uh, 2016. But uh, the reason why I wanted to make this vlog was because I'm connecting with a good friend of mine from high school. His name is Dwayne Perkins. He's a stand-up comic and uh, also a, a podcaster and an actor and a writer. He's got a book. He's multi-talented and uh, a good, nice guy overall. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hang out with him today in uh, Pasadena and watch him record his podcast off the top. It's so sunny today. <laughs> it's crazy. I'm wearing like shorts. Look at this. I'm wearing like shorts. Got like my Dishonored t-shirt on. It's like super nice uh, today. Green trees all around. You can hear birds or something or other in the background there making crazy noises. But um, we're gonna connect with Dwayne and get a little behind the scenes of his podcast. So Dwayne, why did you call your podcast Off the Top? Um, that is a good question. I think it's because um, I wanted it to be just whatever came to my mind off the top of my head. And it's a play on words because I had the lyric of the day and I'm into hip hop music. And, and uh, when rappers freestyle, when they make it up as they go along, we call that going off the top. So um, it's sort of, a, 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 I'm alluding to that, but also it means I'm just talking, you know, I have like some basic things I want to talk about, but then what I'm going to say is not scripted at all. I'm going off the top of my head. All right, so Dwayne, you travel around the world. Yes. Can you give me an example of a joke that you might have to switch up when you're in a different country? Oh, good question. Um, there's a few. Um, surprisingly, most of them work, to be honest. Okay. Most of them work fine. But I have a joke about like what it feels like to be black in America. <laughs> and um, when I'm in Asia, that just won't. <laughs> they, don't, they don't get... I mean, I, I could make it work, but I would have to sort of like give them too many examples and set it up and it would just be, you know. But also um, name brands, I have to change name brands around, especially in England, um, oddly enough. Because see the other countries, they kind of get our movies and they get our TV. So surprisingly, you don't have to switch up a lot. But when you're in England, they have their own names for everything. And they kind of know our names, but they, they, they're more used to using their own names. So um, just I just go, I get there a day early and, I, and I, make sure I have no name brands, names, or anything like that okay. that, I, that I talk about. So most of it, most of it works. Yeah. The Lyric of the Day is the big hit. People, people seem to really like that, you know, even though, um, to me, it's, it's sort of like elementary to explain lyrics. Like, I just understand them. They've been in my life. But I think people like, um, so it's almost like a discussion, but only I'm talking. But I think people like to chime in. I've had people correct me on things, so yeah. So is that something, the lyrical of the day, is it, does it come too easy? Is that what you're saying? In terms of, in terms of breaking down the lyric, yeah, yeah. I mean, because see, what happens is like some people that listen, uh, I know at least one or two people, English isn't their first language, so they're, they're fluent, but to like follow a rap song and know what they're talking about is tough. Also, as a New Yorker, me and you, some of the things they're referencing, we know. I remember a friend of mine didn't get, um, when Five Dog said, bust off on your couch, now Now you got Siemens furniture. She thought it was really crass and crude, and it is, but I had to tell her, well, Siemens furniture is like a it's furniture chain, right? store yeah. in New York, and so it, it wasn't like just dirty for dirty's sake. It was kind of kind of witty and stuff. So I think rappers make these references that not everyone knows, so I'm kind of explaining, because I, I usually know the reference. So there it is, checking out Dwayne Perkins and Off The Top Podcast, a little behind the scenes, chatting it up with uh, my old buddy from back in the day. I will put links in the description below to his podcast, his website. Make sure you check out his special on Netflix, Take Note, and uh, apparently he's got something going on Hulu as well, so you want to check him out on Hulu. Guy's blowing up. You guys make sure you check out his podcast for TV. We'll see you next time.